a little baby redfish oh guys I'm gonna tell you we've got a beautiful day it started out raining and it was pouring at, the, at my house and close to Bloomington and I looked at the weather and I seen that it moved off kind of off to the what would be oh, got a little leak there a little off to the what to be west and I said well I'm gonna come down and see if I can't hook up it was really supposed to blow like crazy today but man that's the blessings whenever you can actually go with the drop of a hat. I fed my cows and I, I looked at it and I said well, let's just go. Now it's starting to sprinkle so I'm going to have to either cover my camera up or something because it's not waterproof anymore. Alright guys, let's just uh, let's go to the next one because that wasn't much of a fish but I think it's just solid little, little ones because I had a lot of little pecks here. But I think there will be a big one amongst them. So all right, we'll see you in a bit. All right, guys. What do we got? Oh, I think it's another small one. But what do we say? <laughs> oh, it's a trout. It's a trout, guys. Hey, that's something I didn't expect. With all this fresh water and this rain, I did not expect a trout. I'll be honest with you guys. If I was having a bet, I would have told you nope. Because, I mean, it it was pouring. All right, I'm not going to... Shh, that was not good. Almost 17. fish it's slimy little rascal though but anyway I don't know if I said it but I want to thank you for tuning in and I just want to thank y'all for you know watching all the time and thank you guys for you know, subscribing and everything. I, I, I'm starting to pick up in the subscription category, so that's cool. Someone would told me this a few months ago that I'd had people like watching me catch fish. I would have told them, uh, no, all I do is go fishing. There ain't nothing that, that special. So anyway, guys, I really thank y'all. Anyway, I might just play around out here and see if there's any more trout because normally trout are a school fish. They're normally not, you know, the ones that just hang by themselves. But anyway, all right, guys, let's see if we can get us another one. All right, what do we got? Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> a little trout, I think. Well, not little. I think he's a keeper. Okay, guys, I uh, hope there's not uh, water on the lens. I'm going to check it after this, but we had a little sprinkle come through. And, and uh, but it is, I'm sorry. All right, that's a nice keeper trout right there. All right, guys. It's, we finally got some tide to come back in. I don't, uh, they weren't really predicting it to be like this, but get in the boat, guy. Okay. Nice, nice, nice trout. Okay. <laughs> Again, I would say I really wasn't expecting trout today. But that'll show you. That'll teach you guys to listen to me. <laughs> I'm kidding. You better go on. Listen. I'm just blessed. Uh, 
I don't know. It hadn't been no no rough water to stir it up, so the salt is heavier than the uh, fresh water. So these guys will lay closer to the bottom and still have the right salinity for them. So, all right, about 17. Yeah, guys. Beautiful. Beautiful. Hey, guys, I was going to tell y'all real quick. You know, I'm a little excited. I, I went on eBay and I found me a new motor for my little skiff. You know, they quit making two strokes as far as I know. But I found a Yamaha 2000, 2009 model. It looked like it's very low hours. Yeah, I got it coming. <laughs> All the way from Michigan. Boy, that ought to be a game changer on my skiff because that 15 four stroke, it never was made for that that motor. It was made for 25. And I have a 2008, so, and it doesn't have a lot of hours. So, in case you know something goes on with these two, we might can make one awesome motor out of the two but he says it runs great so we will see all right guys let's uh get on to the next one Yeah. Hey, not pulling real. Oh, a little flounder. <laughs> Getting boat. <laughs> well, I guess that what we would call a, a Texas slam. He ain't big enough to take, I don't believe. But we had the little baby. Uh, baby I don't want to hurt you but we had the uh, small red and we had a couple of trout and then we got this here oh, do not bite my tip quit quit okay, I'm gonna turn you out turn you loose there you go <laughs> uh, he's about <laughs> oh, he'll be all right. He wasn't stunned too much. He'll take off. All right, guys. <laughs> well, that proves, guys, same retrieve. Caught the little red. Caught all the reds in the past. Caught the two keeper trout today. Um, it's just the retrieve I love. Just straight pull. In case you missed the last video when I explained it, or maybe it was one, one before it. Still fishing with the same bait. Chicken of the sea. Down south lures. And fish have been acting a little funny today after that storm. They're just not. They're just not showing themselves. And plus, we have the 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 biggest tide I've we've had in months, really, since I've been coming out here for a month or two all winter so anyway I'm gonna keep looking but uh, I hadn't really found out where the main group of redfish are hanging out I'm gonna try up in the little flats here in a minute maybe they went up there uh, so all right guys we'll see you in a bit very big but maybe a trout or a little redfish well, whatever it is get out from under the boat oh, it's a not super little red <laughs> guys I'm just out here 
I wasted so much time today doing the same old thing and you know that I've been doing lately and hoping I'd have the same success and well it's a different day with all that rain earlier and everything it's kind of like well you just don't <clears throat> quit quit I don't want to hurt you I don't think you're big enough quit you making me look bad in front of my people. Quit. That ain't right. He ain't trying to be a team player. Uh, well, guys, let's just take a look at him. Oh, man, I ain't even close to having everything right. Uh, get out of here. 19 inches. Your bad self. <laughs> guys, I think I'm going to call it. I might cast a few more times out here. It's just, I seen some redfish along that bank here. And, but I'm just wore out. I, I made a long paddle up a bank and up into a marsh. Thinking that they would be up in the marshes because we had some tide, but they were a few at the mouth, but they were just right in the, they just kind of got spooked when I come in there. And, uh, so guys that just kind of proves that you know i don't hit it every time i mean i i do pretty good but you know there's days and i have a feeling just like catching that one i keep throwing i i end up getting getting something and and if i do we might cut it in here somewhere but i've been at it a while and but anyway i just want to thank y'all for everything and thank you know for watching and everything so y'all have a very blessed day god bless see you next time